Hi, I'm Valder Beebe. I'm the host and the visionary of the Valder Beebe show, God Talk. Some people talk to God and others believe that God talks to them. Join us in conversation with authors, religious clergy, metaphysicians, and regular people like you and I and God Talk. God Talk is a podcast available on FM Radio, Roku TV, and online. Subscribe at ValderBBShow.com. You can also subscribe at YouTube.com slash ValderBBShow. Join the conversation of God Talk. I'll see you there. Well, thank you. I'm so excited you're here to talk about game day. My audience is all ready. Tell me about that. About game day? Mm Mm-hmm. Well, first and foremost, I feel like I'm, I'm the master of game day. You know, I have a cookbook called Game Day Eats. And to me, um, sports and food go hand in hand. You know, you can't think of a sporting event, whether you're at home tailgating, home gating, or at the game itself where food isn't involved. And if it can be delicious food, then I'm all about it. What are some of the delicious foods that we can have on game day that are easy to prepare? Well, you know, what I'm doing now is pairing up with Sweet Earth and doing the veganuary and all your veganuary is all about kind of swapping out you know these meat heavy options you know just the celery sticks that you normally get or carrot sticks that you normally get for game day or at a spread and giving you something that's absolutely amazing so what i've done is created some game day eats that's kind of kind of pays homage to my cookbook so this these uh the, the three things that i have today is the uh, chipotle chicken sliders that's made with the sweet earth mindful chicken then I also have some egg rolls that have a little bit of an Asian twist to it. So it has a little bit of gochujang uh, and molasses in there. I got to pay, you know, stay true to myself and put a little Texas in there with the molasses. Then lastly, I have some chicken poppers. Those are all delicious and they're all finger food, right? Yes, that's the key to game day. You want to make sure you, you know, you have one handers, what I like to call them. You know, my cookbook, I have a whole section that's called one handers. And these are some of the items that you will find. Uh, in the section of my cookbook, you got to have a hand free for a cold beverage, or you got to ha- have a hand free to celebrate with your friends. How easy are these? And I know you said they were easy. <laughs> yeah, that's the beauty of these recipes. They're easy to prepare, don't take a long time. Um, and I think that's the key to having a successful game day party, especially when you have friends of you want to be able to sit down, enjoy the game, have a little bit of fun, interact with, with everyone that's at your house. But you don't want to slave in the kitchen for a long time. So all these recipes take about 20 to 25 minutes. You got to keep in mind that the Sweet Earth Mindful Chicken product um, literally takes about five minutes to heat up. And then all I had to do was go in and give it a little Eddie Flair. Your cookbook, it's doing very, very well from what I've heard. And people yeah. are uh, it's flying off the shelves, as they say. What else could we find in this that would help us on game day? So the cookbook itself has so many creative recipes, uh, you know, everything from chilies to like, you, like I have here, egg rolls, sliders, poppers, but then I also have a whole section that's tied to salads and, and vegetables um, because I always like to keep balance in my life and, and I always spread that word to people. It's like you always want to keep balance. So I got everything, like my grandmother said, from the Rudy to the Tootie in the cookbook to, have you, to, to help you have a successful game day. Okay, so tell me about the sweet that you're connected with. Yeah, so uh, partnering up with Sweet Earth, we have, a, you know, the, in the month of uh, January, it's called Veganuary. So like I said, we're just swapping out some of those heavy options that you usually eat and giving you uh, some, 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 some options that you can use that are, that are plant-based and meatless. And this sweet steak, there's so many things that you can win. Uh, you can win a plant-based game day pack, or if you're lucky enough, you can be catered by yours truly, Eddie Jackson. I'll come to your house and we'll have a little bit of fun. And uh, all you oh, have I to do is that one. <laughs> yeah, all you have to do is go to sweetearthfoods.com, or you can check it out on the Instagram, Sweet Earth Foods, also on Instagram, and that's how you can find out more about the sweet steaks. And very quickly, I've got this uh, post from Twitter. They want to know about some plant-based alternatives. What do you tell us about that a little bit? Plant-based alternatives. What, what do you mean? Uh, this is a plant-based okay. alternative. This is this is the best that it gets right here. <laughs> no, the thing about it is, one. yeah, that's what they wanted to know. Or, or, or any plant-based alternatives in your cookbook too? 
I need to yeah, add so that. Yeah, so the good thing it. about the good thing about this product and and one of the, the the major reasons why I decided to partner up with them is that I stand behind it. The 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 taste is amazing. Um, it's easy to prepare. Like I said, it only takes about five minutes to heat up. And then on top of that, it has amazing texture. A lot of times when you get into these meatless uh, products, the texture is lacking. So saying that, it's easy to kind of substitute meat, I mean, substitute this product for meat in any recipe, whether it be a chili, whether it be a slider, egg rolls, or the poppers that I have here. You can easily put in that sweeter of mindful chicken into any recipe that I have that have, you know, like chicken or, say, beef. All right, I want my audience to know that Chef Eddie Jackson, he's a former NFL player, and he's a fierce competitor in the kitchen or well on the field. It doesn't matter. Chef, where can we find out more information for our wrap-up with you? Yeah, so if, you, uh, if you're interested in the sweet steaks, you can go to SweetEarthFoods.com. Also, their Instagram is SweetEarthFoods. Um, and also, more about me, Eddie Jackson, Chef Eddie Jackson, on Instagram, and also that's my website as well. Well, I'm going to get you cookbook because I love the the um, ideas you brought to us for game day. So thanks for being a guest on the Valderby Show. I really appreciate it, Chef. Hey, thanks for having me.